Well, a very good evening to you as you join us for tonight's live game. Unfortunately, our weather forecast is somewhat less than promising. We're told to expect intermittent spells of heavy rain, which might very well impact on the quality of the football later. It'll certainly add a new dimension, especially for those players who like to keep hold of the ball. A few anxious faces, hoping it will all somehow stay away. But I have to tell you that, we are told, is an extremely unlikely scenario. This is one of the most spectacular new venues, certainly in terms of design, it is the Allianz Parquet. We stand for the national anthem of France. has got the juices flowing and now this two high-profile, high-caliber teams. This is a welcome event for all these supporters. Well, on the face of it, Peter, we would appear to have a high-caliber meeting with very little at stake. But then you consider a, a chance for one or two of the fringe players to get a look in, and this becomes a big incentive. It changes the dynamic. So there's plenty at stake for them, which will do no harm to the energy levels and the overall conviction, and hopefully, the style of contest. So that's got things on the way. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Yeah, Kylian Mbappe. There's nothing more frightening for a defender when he's running at you at full speed. He gets into a stride so quickly and seems to just glide across the turf, but... to start and what a contribution from the main man I had a feeling he might do something given his reputation but to do it like that absolutely brilliant I wasn't expecting that lovely goal perfect poise to set himself for the strike France trail at this early stage. How will they respond? Rabio tries to get it forward quickly. Conte. Good ball, it's found its target. Now it's and the finish! It's anyone's ball. That's gone a long way up and away. Rafael Varan. Conte, Rabio, Griezmann, oh, that's not going to make it, Vertonghen, then Donka, Vertonghen leads it over to the other flank, Mertens, Tielemans, and it's Mertens. Griezmann. Griezmann drives it forward. Mbappe is... Hits one! 
Courtois gives chase. Can take, he's given away a free kick. Rafael Varan over to the left. Keeper's ball. Talking as out. But he's the guilty party there. Tielemans. Uh, more than happy to take the muscular approach. Pogba, Benzema, has a goal! He's had a shot! And yes, it's there! They are right back in business. Great reactions in front of goal. He just saw what was on. Oh, look, there's only one player who merits all the praise for that. Not only did he finish it, but his instincts for being where he was are absolutely top-notch. France grabbed the equaliser and we're all square. Well, they just couldn't have responded any better, Peter. Yeah, there's the old cliche about how teams can lose focus after scoring, but you still... Lukaku! Oh, that's a terrific save from the keeper. Lukaku is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save. A lovely little footballing moment. Forward. Driving on now, what can they conjure from here? It's Benzema! He's pulled off a fine save. Oh, that's a sparkling save, absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra-sharp. Hoists it high. Oh, delightful ball. Carrasco. Kimpembe has got himself a free kick. Keeper's got good distance on that. Pavar. France have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to Benzema. Benzema really got caught in a trap there, and he just couldn't get out. Across the field it goes. Oh, they've seen lots of the ball. Time to go for it a bit. A bit of creativity and adventure. Talking as up. Now it's Carrasco. 
And it's Murnier. That's surely a foul free kick. The referee has resisted the temptation to go to his pocket. It's just a stern lecture. Mbappe absolutely focused then on the defensive side of his game. Well, they say that your front lads should be that first line of, um, of stopping the opposition, and I think he's taken it to another level with his desire to get back and, and help everyone out. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. For Tongan. For Tongan with the crossfield ball. Still a little short of forward momentum, lacking thrust. Hoists it forward. Kimpembe attempts a clearance. Mertens. And here's Carrasco. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. Dinia. That's the throw. And it's played forward. Tielemans. So midway through the first half, and it is a tight old tie. Aldevero switches it towards the other side. Belgium getting a lot of touches here, but they're not making much progress. Tongan goes looking. Meunier. Torgan Azar. Mertens. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Rabio. Forward it goes. And here's Benzema. Mbappe. And it's Dinia. A really good feat from him. Conte. Popper. Rabio. Popper. 15 minutes till half time. And here's Benzema. Conte. Pogba. Defense has got rid of that. And that's sprayed out wide. Conte. He could be in here. Shut it go! Well and truly turned on its head. France are so well practiced in the art of keeping the ball through wonderful passing and movement and a real appetite to ensure it's reflected in their goal count. So we have a breakthrough, now how will things develop from here? Yeah, for me this team seems to find it easier to attack than defend, but now they're going to need to dig in at the back a bit. Meunier tries to switch the play. Torgan Azar. This 
this is promising. It's Lukaku! That has skinned the post. Oh, and it's such a good effort. And maybe the target really should have been hit. Conte, Kimpembe, Digne, Belgium are trailing here with the first half almost done, Digne plays it forward, and here's Benzema, oh it's die-hard defence and the willingness to put his body on the line, very impressive. Out to the left it goes. And it's got through. Torgan Azar. Just brushed off the ball there. Plenty waiting in the middle. Then Donka. And here's Lukaku, has a pop! Chance again? No. This is proving to be a very good spell. The intensity is great, but uh, they've got to make it count. And it's Conte. He's making good use of his strength there, just refuses to be outmuscled. Done very well to intervene. Kimpembe. Conte. Digne. Conte. Rabio. Here it comes. Has a hit! Oh, extraordinary. Well, that's why we all say indecision is fatal. Hoist it forward. Talking as up. Time added on will be two minutes. And that has been cleared. Shoots! No, not quite. Well, I can understand why his thinking was that way inclined. Pogba. Rabio, and the first 45 minutes are up. So a really good half of football, three goals and just one separating them. And we are... So off we go once more. Belgium need to get the balance right to sort this out. Ambition must be complemented by just the right amount of caution and I think the more experienced players can oversee that. Then Donka. Alderweireld. Denier. Tielemans. Alderweireld. Forward pass. And it's Murnier. Mertens. 
Meunier. Alderweireld looking cross field, changing the point of attack. Beautifully done. Pereira Carrasco. Then Donka. Pereira Carrasco. Carrasco spreads it towards the left. Oh, that's nice. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. Shoots! Tries to get it clear. Ball's gone out of play. Alderweireld. And here's Mertens. Tielemans. He does have an assist to his name. Goes for goal! Pogba. Havar. Conte. And it's played forward. Yeah, it looks like a, a change of approach, and it may just freshen things up. And it's Murnier. Conte. Rabio. Mbappe. Benzema. Talk about singling someone out. Yeah, Peter, and it looks like this defence will go tooth and nail to prevent him from uh, from getting another. Denier tries to get it forward quickly. Belgium really looking to get back into this at the start of the second half. And he's made sure that that won't get through. It's come through and he's had a quick look in. Massive leap! You know, he couldn't get the direction he needed. Now that was a slick move, and there were several options in the box to uh, to pick out. Rabio, forward it goes. Mbappe. Oh, sweet feet. And it's Pogba. This could fall anywhere. Pogba. Pogba with the delivery. Meunier gets good distance on it. a look and place it tries a shot is it out of harm's way Pogba and he's there to clear it Alderweireld Inia cuts it out Then Donka. And it's Murnier. Well, this is exactly the approach they have to take now, Peter. Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this. It really is a question of needs must. Spot on, Peter. That in 
intervention was very necessary. For Tongan. Denier tries to get it forward quickly. Kimpembe. Conte. Rabio. Kimpembe. Dina. Rabio. Mbappe. Rabio. Pogba. Benzema. Pogba! Mighty close. Pogba nearly produced a moment of magic. He knew the strike was pure. And the referee has brought play back and showed him a yellow card. That's a foul, free kick's been given. He knew what was coming, that's a yellow card. <laughs> Torkan Azar. Looking for a decent ball in. Varane with a fine tackle. Torgan Azar. Timely intervention. Pavard can hoist it clear. Mertens plays it out to the wing. And he just whacks it away. Carrasco decides to play it back. Griezmann. Pavar. 75 minutes played. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? Mbappe, the Donka gets into the right position to intercept. Dina. That is Conte. France are looking to make this one safe. They want to reduce the risk. He's found his man. Carrasco. Oh, some tackle that. And it's hoisted clear. Belgium are definitely not going down without a scrap. Their attitude just can't be faulted. Griezmann plays it out to the flank. Up for the header! Decent attempt, but not quite good enough. Oh, no, that was a chance. What a chance. Oh, that's clearly not what he wanted to do. Meunier. Hoists it forward. Tielemans. Belgium are in dire need of a breakthrough. Can they? All they need is one big chance, and it may do the trick. And it's played forward. Mbappe. Mbappe just doesn't give up. You just know he'll be in there again before long. Oh, look, his determination needed to be greater than the obstacle he was faced with, and it wasn't. 
Meunier desperately wants to get on the end of this. Kante did well to step in there. That was more than necessary. Torgan Azar. Belgium have a simple task to find something sustained now and keep the pressure on. Yeah, it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Denier. Forward it goes. Tielemans. Tries to switch the play. And it's Murnier. Looks to thread it. Oh, shooting chance! It's off target and by quite a way. Ah, oh, now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but he couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. And here's Benzema. Benzema. It's Benzema! Try. The outcome could so easily have been different. Well, he doesn't need a second invitation, even from that range. Rafael Varane, Kimpembe, Rabio, Hernandez. Mbappe. That is terrific skill. Hernandez, Rabio. And that's that, and in the end, it got away. They just weren't allowed to build on their lead, they lost their lead, and they lost the game. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? Well, the game plan for me just looked a little confused, and the crowd seemed to pick up on this early on, and it just created a kind of negative vibe around the whole stadium, and I think this performance was one best deleted from the memory bank now. And that's where we have to end it. From me, Peter Drury, and my co-commentator, Jim Beglin, a very good evening to you all.